Hey guys, so now we are going to be taking a look at the MV command or the move command. And the MV command in Linux is basically like a superhero, man. I love it. And you can do a bunch of cool stuff with it um, with your files and folder. And you can just, you can do a lot of cool stuff like moving stuff. <laughs> and that's why I love it. And you can also use it to rename a file or directory or move in a file or directory to another location I will show you what I mean by that so the syntax for this command let's go to say MV right the MV if we do like help it will give you the help commands over here so you can take a look at this just read it and you know get familiar with it it's, it's a really good command that we're going to be using a lot so let's say um, MV command right so the the syntax of this is the first command is going to be an option and then the source and then the destination right but if you don't give it an option it's just going to do source and destination all right but you do need to have a source and a destination in here so let me show you an example of renaming a file right let's go ahead and say ls or ls we can see that we have file one, right? If I want to rename file one, all I need to do is mv file one dot txt, and I just the second action is going to be the rename. Let's say no no one dot txt. Press enter. Do an ls. You can see that file one, which was over here before I rename it right here, now is gone. But now it is called no no one dot txt. So that is one of the way that you can use the move command or the mv command is that you can rename um, a text. You can also rename a folder. Let's go ahead and say clear. Let's do mv and what do we have? We have like hell in here. And I just want to name this no no. All right. So now we're doing that lesson here. We can see that we have the directory of no no right we rename the hell directory to no no right so we rename a um, a text file and also a directory how about if i want to move a file to a directory how do i do that well it's really simple first let's go ahead and make sure there's a there's nothing in this directory right ls no no there is nothing in here so what i want to do is i want to move this no no one that txt to this no no directory so you do mv and then you do what you want to move first no no that txt and where you want to move it so i want to move it to no no right there we go that has me move and now if we do to to list in here you can see that no no that txt is in there how about if i want to move it out and move it back to the desktop well what you can do is do an mv in here and you want to look for that file that you want to move so no no and then no no txt and let's say that you want to move it back to what is it the home home cali desktop and if we do a dot that means is that it's going to keep the same name but I, what i could do is i can just rename it if i want to let's say no no to that txt i want to name it no no that to that txt so i wanted to take it out and then i want you to name it no no to the txt there we go so now if we do list directory and no no directory there's nothing but now if i do an lsla you can see that we actually moved it and then after we move it back out of it we rename it to no no to that txt isn't that kind of cool it is really cool what you can do with the mv command and now i'm going to show you how to move multiple files at once using the mv command let's go ahead and do a clear and do an ls again and let's do an LSLA so it displays it like this. I like it better. So let's do, I want to move the file two, three, four, and five. I want to move it into, or actually, let's kind of rename hello first. MV, hello, I want to name it file LSLA. So now we have that um, directory called file. So what I want to do is I want to move file one and file two file three file four 
and file five. I want to move it into the file directory. The directory, let's see file, oh, file one does not exist. I don't have file one. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and do that again. So there's no, it's telling me, wait, did I do an LS? Oh, yes, I did. Let's go ahead and do, go to LS file. Everything should be in there now. There you go. So why was it telling me that? That's funny. All right, so here we go. File two, three, four, five, six. Oh, not six. Two, three, four, five. They were moved into this directory called file. Right? So that's looking good. Let's go ahead and clear and ls. There we go. That's really good. So that's how you are able to move multiple files into a directory. Okay, so now let's go ahead and do an ls file. And we're going to see we have file three. So file three, I want to move file three to the directory one three four five six so if we go to mv you want to go into the file directory and do file two i want to move you to one two three four five six directory but i want to change the name to one two three four five six dot txt voila so now if we do an ls one two three four five six you can see that text was moved and if we do an ls file you will see that file 2 is not there anymore because it got moved to the 123456 directory and we also changed the name to 123456.txt all right guys so yep yeah, that is it for this video guys thank you for watching like always see you on the next one